When you hear the Sanctum is another tower defense game, your reaction might be, another one? But you should give this interesting game a chance. What makes it different is that you build and upgrade towers from a first person perspective. And then, when the monsters all march towards you, you don't just let your turrets do all the work. Instead, you take aim with your own weapons and start shooting. Sanctum doesn't have much content compared to other tower defense games. It's only three levels and two modes, single player and co-op. But what's here is good and worth checking out, even if you're bored with tower defense. Each level is split into a series of waves. Like in most such games, you build turrets. And like in some others, you must use tower blocks to create a maze for the monsters to traverse in order to slow them down and maximize the effectiveness of your turrets. The twist is that once you've spent your available resources and the monsters start coming, you also take aim and shoot. To that end, you get an assault rifle, a sniper rifle, and a gun that slows the weird creatures down. The shooting itself isn't very satisfying yet it's rewarding to see the corpses pile up or to watch a bobblehead's noggin explode when you land a headshot. Between waves, you decide whether to build new blocks, add turrets, replace turrets with different ones, or upgrade your weapons. You can take a few different approaches, giving Sanctum a nice amount of flexibility. That flexibility may be enough to get you to return once you finish the single player mode. However, the game is still on the bear side. Considering how many modes and how much content you get with games like Toy Soldiers and Comet Crash, there's not a ton of variety, but you can join a friend or stranger in cooperative play. It's definitely fun to devise strategies together and see how much damage you can do shooting as a team. However, the co-op gets absurdly difficult and frustrating, which comes as kind of a shock considering the smooth difficulty curve of the single player. Yet, Sanctum is fun to play and interesting, too. It's also quite attractive. It has the typical sci-fi jungle look, but the lush trees and the glimmering details make you feel like you're a small part of a larger world. So, if you appreciate games that offer cool twists on familiar mechanics, Sanctum might be right up your alley.